Yo, what is going on guys? I'm back with another video. If you haven't already, and you wanna learn how to script a little more with my girlfriend, check out part one on teaching my girlfriend how to script. And yesterday I made a part two on this, and this one's a little bit more funnier. So part three is gonna be coming real soon. Uh, love you guys. Continue watching the video, and I hope you guys enjoy. All right, so here I'm making an audio for the shower. All right, so let's get started. So first off, what we're gonna do is we're going to, uh, you know, just add a few comments and whatever. Um, and if you enjoy, please drop a like and check in the description for the model. But right here, we're gonna be making some variables for the shower. All right, so next, what we're gonna do is for the clickable part, we're gonna add a click detector in there. We're gonna add the event mouse click and then the parameter for that is the player. So we're gonna just print the player's name. So it's been a while since I actually scripted. So yeah, so we're checking that right now. We're just seeing if, you know, my scripting skills are still all right. So we're gonna check, um, we made a variable for shower on, we made it false. So we're gonna check if it's off uh, if it's false, so basically if the shower's off, which whenever you join the game should be off, so everything can run properly. We're gonna turn that variable, um, we're gonna make it true. Um, this is just to have a debounce for five seconds so you can turn it on and off in five seconds so you don't have, so you can't rapidly, rapidly click it. Um, then we're gonna get everything, you know, we're gonna enable the mist, the water, and the shower knob on we're gonna search through that model and we're gonna change all the parts transparency to zero so what i'm doing right there is so because i have two models for the little shower knob um if it's on it's going to be pointing up if it's off it's going to be pointing down so that's why i changed the transparency um now i kind of miss scripting scripting um, is very fun i enjoy it so that's why I'm trying to get back into it after like two years. Um, but right here we have else if, uh, basically it's just checking if it's stop, is it way around? Like if the shower's on, um, but yeah, 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 yeah. And also in the, in the comments section, let me know what kind of videos y'all would want to see. If y'all have any more requests, um, I really enjoyed scripting this. It's, helping me get back into scripting um, but yeah in this video I print a good bit just to see if I'm scripting it correctly and I think it's right here that I got stuck or maybe it was a little before or maybe after I'm not too sure because it wasn't printing shower off yeah I think I'm about to struggle with that actually because once I figure it out I think I take out that print but yeah, um, at the very end of this, um, which is coming up pretty soon, uh, about the three in three minutes. Oh, let's see. In about, no, nah, I'm tripping, tripping. Um, but I'm almost finished scripting this. And then the next part is going to be uh, where we have the sound for the shower. So I added that clip in just so I can get an idea and see you know what's going on so yeah right here we're making the sound so and with this sound I was curious how to get it working because the sound was 30 seconds long and what i was trying to figure out was if the shower stayed on the sound would play but how would it continue you know if you didn't turn the shower off how would it keep playing so i was struggling with that but i found out um, a property called uh, time position so i messed around a little bit with that um yeah, so right here for Val, which is gonna stand for volume, we're gonna make it fade whenever you turn the shower off. So 
So yeah, I don't know what I'm thinking about right here in this part, but I think I'm just struggling with something, trying to figure out something. All right, so we're making a spawn function. Um, it's been a really long time since I messed with that. I mean, of course, it's been a while since I scripted, so um, spawn came to my head. I was thinking, I thought that was the right function that I was using, and I was right whenever I typed up spawn, it turned blue, so I knew it was something that could be used. Uh, I remembered it correctly. So spawn, this function is going to work on its own. It's basically like a new script for itself. So we're just checking if the shower is on. Um, basically, if the shower is if the shower is continuing continuously running. So then, in a little bit, I'm going to be adding a wait loop, um, a while loop. I'm sorry, a while loop, just to continuously check if the shower has been running. Print this doesn't work. That is because I need a while loop to be checking continuously and that's where this comes in right here. And I think this time it should work. Oh no, I'm still messing with it. Oh yeah, because it's not going to equal to 10 exactly. So I forgot how to do greater than or equal to in Roblox. I did it kind of backwards right here. So yeah, there it is, I figured it out. But yeah, I did it the opposite way around. There it is, fixed. All right, so we got that printed. So it seems to be working. So change the time position to six. So it repeats. Now I'm making a little debounce right here. Can set back as my variable name. So we're gonna have this can set back variable inside of the loop. So we're, yeah, we're gonna add that weight there because it was running a little too fast. So right here, I'm just messing with the the fade, trying to get it uh, on point because the sound would kind of fade too fast or too slow. So I'm just messing around with that. Here, I put it in a spawn function so it can run on its own so it doesn't affect the script. And I added the stop function for the sound so it stops and doesn't continuously play even though I lowered the volume, had the volume fade. But yeah, that is basically it. And if you guys enjoyed and stuck through the video, I would appreciate if you liked and subscribed and let me know in the comment section what else you would want. Love you all. Peace out.